This is Twit. Y'all matter. Google affiliated smart home protocol interoperability. Whoop whoop. Um, whoop. It's Google, Amazon, Facebook, not Facebook, sorry, Google, Amazon, Apple, Apple and Samsung. Samsung. All got together and were like, hey, let's make your smart home stuff interoperable. They called it Project Chip for a while. Now it became Matter, or it became Matter earlier this year. And it was supposed to be out this fall, but they're going to delay it until the first half of next year. And while oh, I am sad. Sorry, Stacy. I'm sorry. I know. It's what's very the, so disappointing. Con, con, what's contributing to the delay? A couple things. One, I think they're doing this a little differently. They are releasing a full software development kit. So the full SDK is going to come out and they realize that, oh, they, I think they took a look at their code and they were like, we should work on this a little bit longer. Um, I think the co the COVID coming back, uh, the Delta variant has kind of pushed them tests back a little bit, some of the uh. testing events. But also, I mean, I'm really sad. They say also that more companies joined, but I think that's just a, b a BS kind of just, mm. you know. If you can't handle 20 more companies joining your standards organizations at the last minute, that's a problem. So I'm gonna hope that's not the real issue. Um, but I think it's actually okay, because I'd rather have a good standard coming out. It's really disappointing for people like me who are waiting to buy new smart home stuff that's matter certified. We should still see people releasing their plans at CES or in that time frame. But, um, but it is kind of a letdown. Is it still worth waiting for a matter certified yes. device? You think so? Yes, I, I'm getting a lot of people who are a little unsure about what Matter is going to do. So people are like, oh, I need a new doorbell. I, I'm going to wait and buy a Matter one. I was like, don't do that because doorbells aren't part of the certification. If you're waiting to buy new locks, new light bulbs, maybe a new HVAC, those kind of things, then yes, sure, wait. But don't wait. And I would also say, realistically, the soonest you're going to buy a Matter certified device is going to be the latter half of next year. Ooh, right? so a year from so, now. So, I mean, you can buy things that are likely to be upgraded. Like Philips says, hey, we're going to upgrade everything. So if you want to invest in new Philips light bulbs, great. Um, the nano leaf bulbs, things, some of these things people have already, if the, people have come out, go ahead and buy it. But like, I would not buy door locks right now because none of the lock makers are like, this is what we're doing. Um, Actually, you say so, in your article that it's going to be first half of next year for the SDK and the start of a certification yes. program, which means probably it's going to be the following year. later that you'll actually be able to get devices. Uh, it'll be towards the holiday season of yeah. next year, I think, yeah. yes. I mean, there's some, like, Google and Amazon, they're going to have their stuff ready. And a lot of the companies who are participating, they're already working with this stuff. Yeah. So yeah, so it will be pretty quick. They're working on the SDK and development. Yeah. So, But if you yeah. if you are part of the membership and you, you don't have access to any of this, then yeah, it's going to be a right. little bit longer for you. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to not home automate until next year. Yes? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. <laughs> I haven't missed it so far. <laughs> I do. Actually, no, I have few lights. And I was I can, like, Leo, I, have I know you have home automation stuff. I have stuff. some home automation. I have doorbells. I have... You know, voice assistance. But I can say, you know, turn off the lights, turn on the lights. And there's lights in the living room and lights in my office. How is it possible that these lights can be upgraded? I would assume there's some hardware limitations. So a lot of the lights that will be upgraded. So Philips has two brands. They have their fancy Hue ones mm -hmm. and they have their cheaper Wiz ones. The cheaper Wiz ones will not be upgraded. The hues will be because they're running through a hub, so the hub will get a software oh, update that talks okay. to the lights. That makes sense. Yeah. Okay. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah. Some lights that run things, well, no, yeah, no. We'll just go with no. Some of the lights, like Nano Leaf, put out light bulbs with thread enabled, and they did that to make it eventually compatible with Matter. 